Hello everyone, welcome back to City Skylines. So the last episode we got, again, I don't remember what I did. Um, oh yeah, the sewage, the sewage we got done, right. So we've gotten public transportation, we've gotten sewage done lately. Shaping up to be a really good city, really, really is. I just want to say thank you real quick to everyone. Um, I am getting ready to hit, or have just now hit, uh, 10,000 views on my channel. So thank you to everyone so much. Uh, I really do appreciate all of the support that you have been giving me so far over the last six months since I've started this channel. <coughs> Pardon me. Now all we have to do is get that subscriber count up there. So if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do so. Anyway, this episode, what I want to focus on is I want to focus on the university. I want to get University Square built up to its name. Um, so I'm really happy to start working on that. And also we're going to see what kind of a dent we can do in our population. Because the next population milestone that we have is at 50,000. 50,000 is the next milestone. And then right after that is 65,000. Once we hit 65,000, as you can see, we will unlock all 81 tiles. And that is going to be where we get into a lot of fun stuff. But in order to do that, we have to build up the center island. We have to get this taken care of in order to do the rest of these islands. So what I'm going to do now is let's get into University Square. Okay. Um, let's take a look at the universities that we have. So we have Ham University and we have University Camp Main Campus. So University Main Campus isn't too bad, but it's, I mean, it's a little small um, and a little boring. Now, Ham University, on the other hand, this one I always like. This one is usually my default go-to um, for what I like to do. So I think what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to off set it here like do instead of it being center which i usually like and it usually drives me crazy when something is not center <laughs> um but you know i mean center is about here but i'm also looking at this road right here right so let's go ahead and put this there <clears throat> and then what this is going to allow me to now do is i have these dorms that i can put in here um, i have two different dorms I have this one that has parking lots on it, and then on the back side it has, um, oh, what does it have on there? It's like it got like a bike path or something like that. And then this is just a regular campus dorm. There's nothing too extravagant about that. Um, and then the other things that we have with it are these uh, faculty buildings. So the faculty buildings, uh, university students uh, who wish to specialize in certain areas to these facilities, uh, or to use these faculty buildings. Eh, my God, I can't talk. I also can't breathe if you can't hear it in my voice. Um, I'm coming down with a cold, so I'm trying to trying to really kind of get over it. I mean, it hasn't even started, but I'm trying to get over it too. So anyway, um, also if I cough while doing this, please accept my apologies now for it. Speaking of, <coughs> pardon me. All right, anyway. Now, what I want to do with this is, yeah, we could put this in here. We could put regular roads in there, but eh, boring. Um, and regular roads are just going to take up way too much, way too much. Um, so what I want to do is not these regular paths, but I want to do these pedestrian roads. Now, the pedestrian roads are part of a mod. Uh, the mod is crap. Um <laughs> Nope, that's not the name of the mod. The name of the mod is not crap. The name of the mod is Network Extensions 2. Yes, Network Extensions 2. That is the name of the mod. Um, that's what you want to use. Now with this, this will allow um, traffic to drive on them, um, but they are also pedestrian paths, and they do light traffic. Um, and you can go in here with the Traffic Manager tool, and you can actually... Um, uh oh, that's not what I want. Um, I, I hit the wrong button. That was disabled despawning. I don't want to do that. Uh, where's it at? Here we go. Uh, vehicle restrictions. So I can actually select this and pick and choose what vehicles I want on here or not. Um, not going to do that right now. That's probably going to be in the live episode. Um, 
tentatively that is going to be on January 13th. Uh, not sure. Actually, it is going to be on the 13th. I just don't know the time yet. So time is to be determined. TBD. Um, and then the date will be January 13th. All right, so I'm going to stop yammering here. Uh, so let's see. This is going to go out this way. So what I want to do is have this little road come down here and connect up. And then over here is where we're going to have the dormitories, right? And then I think I'll be safe to put that going that way. And then this is actually going to connect up there. Yeah. And actually, I'll continue that on there, that way as well. Because uh, da -da -da -da. we also have these faculty buildings that I want to put in too. But these I want to put in like over here at the actual university piece of it. Um, this is going to be dormitories and oh, let's see what else. Yeah, let's just kind of look at this here. Oops. Dang it. All right. If I hit the microphone again, I'm going to scream. I keep, I have this bad habit of hitting the microphone with my headset because I get too freaking close to the microphone. I'm used to the microphone being in front of me and not off to the, just to the side of me. And it's still taking some adjustment to, to do. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, right. So let's put those two dorms in there on the main road. No. Move that over here. I want to put them off the main road. And then I want to connect the bicycle paths. Um, ooh, maybe. Maybe not. No? Can I not? Ah. All right. That is why we have road anarchy, so we can do this. <laughs> I know. So many mods to, to cheat a little bit, but you know what? It works, right? I mean, it works. Anyway. So... Those two are there. Now, what about... So we have two big ones. Why don't I put... Uh, why don't I go ahead and put another large one here. Another one over here. Okay. And actually, I want to go ahead and put one there and one there. Another one there and another one there. So this is actually going to create a lot of living space. Actually, it's going to create a ton of living space. Um, I'll put no, no, not what I wanted. Let's connect all these bike paths up together. And then we'll connect, oh, come on. Yep, that's what I want to do. So then this bike path will go down to there. This bike path, eh, it's not going to connect that way. That will connect to there. Okay. Now, the thing that I don't really like about the bike paths is I don't think it'll allow any actual pedestrians on here. It's the only thing I don't like about them. But we can fix that. I think. I hope. Um, get rid of that. I don't, I don't need that. Now, what I want to do is take a regular path down this length, and I should, I mean, it's a little wonky, it's a little, I need to take all of that stuff off of there. Basically, what I'm doing is I am creating walk paths along the same as the bike path. Actually, that doesn't even need to be there because that is a walk path. Um, but I do need to have one needs to go along here. Okay. So we have a walk path there, bike path there. Um, is this one going to fit? Not really. Eh, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I'm okay with that. For now. For now. I think we'll end up going into the details a little bit more uh, in the live episode. That's what we'll do.
We'll just get the buildings down for now. We'll do the details later. Dang it. Okay. All right, so now that I've got that in here, let's look at this aspect of it, the faculty piece of it. Um, and let's put, uh, let's go in and put three down on this side. And then where is that at? I want these to be kind of the same. There we go. So do three there and three there. Uh, I guess it would help if I gave water to this area. Turn my angles back on and stuff. Put that back over there. There we go. All right, so that's all connected up. Now, of course, now that we're putting all this education in here, our um, <laughs> residential is going to skyrocket. <coughs> Pardon me. All right, so I've got that in there. And then the next thing that I want to do is I want to add in a little bit of commercial. Um, with this being, believe it or not, what I want to do is look at where okay university square is in here is this all what is this is that commercial nope that's office space okay that's fine um i can take i want high density let's put one there and i'm gonna put that there So what I'm going to do is I am taking this high density commercial and I'm going to take this area and I'm going to give it not tourism. I want to give it leisure. So leisure is, yeah, it's going to cause a lot of noise pollution, but it's a college area. So we want it to have all of those like, um, you know, that nightlife, right? You want to have the bars and you want to have the... Um, restaurants and all of that kind of stuff that, you know, a little college town has. Well, not a college town, but a college area would have. All right, so let's add in a little spot right here. And then I'm going to add in a spot next to the dorms. I think I'll leave that open, but I'll put some there. And actually, I will go ahead and put, take a road and put it down through here. And then put in commercial space there. And then I'm actually gonna put in, let's put commercial space in through there. And then we'll put in some low density commercial in here. And then one over there. That'll work. And then actually put in some more high density there. Perfect. I think that's gonna help us out a lot. Uh-oh. That ah, crap. Now ah, what? Uh, what is this? Not enough goods to sell? Yeah, whatever. I will get you more goods later. <coughs> okay. Awesome. Perfect. All right, so now that we've got that established, um, next thing I want to do is get, obviously, a bus needs to go from Grand Central over to here. I mean, I know it's not that far, but I mean, really, it's just kind of like a shuttle bus in a sense. Um, I really don't think I need to have it on the actual or in the actual bus depot itself. Then again, no, I'm not going to do that. No, 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 no. No, no, because what I'm going to do is this will be connected via the monorail. That's what I'll do. 
this. Ooh, great idea. Okay, so here, yeah, on the outside of here, this needs to be let me see I need that I need that and I need I think this yes yes that is exactly what I need um, dang it why is this not why is this being a pain come on there we go all right that needs to be <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me. Alright, that needs to go in that direction. I think there is going to be good. Yeah, there will be fine. Um, There we go. Alright, so we'll connect that back up. Alright, that actually needs to be upgraded. I don't know why I just did that when it has to be upgraded. Now, my only concern with this is I have this going under the highway. But I'm not going to be able to upgrade this road. And I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to... Oh, I might. I might actually be able to do this. Okay. So then if I go like that. Oops, that is not a 90 degree angle. That is not what I want. So I'm going to have to have this. Um, I'm going to have to have all of that come off of there. I said take it off of there. <laughs> My gosh. All right, so that is going to need to come over to about, uh, let's say right there. Have it come straight across. Turn all that back on. Okay, upgrade this, and I can't. Oh, okay, well that's fine, that's fine. Because I can upgrade this. And that actually gives this a lot more room to get into there. Okay, that's no big deal. So then I'll take this in there. Um, no. This will come out to there and connect up there that's not straight <laughs> that doesn't work for me Arr. Eh, you know what a little curve in it isn't gonna hurt it it's fine but that'll be good though so then we'll go that's actually that works out really really well so then I'll take a monorail line from Grand Central to there and then back. And then I can call that, that'll be um, hub to college. No. To university, not a college. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I love it. Now, what I need to be able to do, though, is I have to have... So this needs to connect up to the road. And then this needs to connect up to the road. Okay. And actually, what I need to do is I need to have the bicycle path hook up to the road as well without destroying the path. I don't think there's any way for me to do that without destroying the path. All right, so if I hook up the bicycle path there. Okay, okay. And then I take this and go up with it. 
can go over and then down. Aha! There we go. It's a little odd, you know, the angle of it and everything. Ooh, that's a that's a little steep. <laughs> that's pretty freaking steep. Um, is she gonna walk up it? Oh, she did. She did. She climbed up it. <laughs> I'm leaving it. I'm totally leaving it. All right. All right. All right. All right. Um, I'm getting a lot done in this episode. <laughs> I really am. I'm loving this. Uh, are there people on here right now? Uh, let's see. Zero out of 260. So no, there is nobody on there right now. Give it time though. Give it time. I think that's definitely going to help out a lot though. All right. So next thing that I want to do, um, I mean, we, you know, we've got plenty of time. I mean, this, this works out really, really well. Uh, we've got uh, 1,097 students in here. Um, students in the city is 2,067, so it's really just a matter of, you know, getting the people over here themselves. All right, so I guess next I will go ahead and start increasing the population. Now, I'm pretty sure I have a high-rise ban on all this, and I do. All right, so high in demand for residential right now. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and really just kind of start filling this all in. So let's fill, I mean, we already have the road set for out here. So let's just fill all this in. And hopefully we can uh, increase this pretty exponentially. I'm going to add in a little bit of shopping. Actually, I'm going to add in a lot of bit of shopping. Um, yeah, I think that'll be okay. Actually, let's get rid of that and get rid of that. Okay. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay. That is nice. That I'm really enjoying right now. All right. Now. That's going to take a minute to build up. Let's go ahead and fast forward this so that can build up some. Um, traffic tends to be... Traffic actually seems to be doing all right coming into the city now. It's actually not doing too bad. Um, and I know the biggest hang up was this right here. Still don't understand what is happening with this. I don't get it. I don't know why there is. I wonder if I can do this. Disable despawning. Nope. That does it for the entire area. Doesn't help me. <sighs> I don't know. If anyone knows how to fix a despawning and spawning area, please let me know. Because this is really annoying. I'm just saying. All right, so University Square is building up pretty well. Uh, let's see, let's take a look at Pear Hills. Pear Hills seems to be doing okay. Um, highly doubt that we're gonna get up to the 50,000 that I really want to in this episode, cause we're only at uh, 36,500. But what I can do now, let's go ahead and start mapping out this area here, shall we? Uh, let's see. Let's go back into this. And that's going to go straight across. This is going to come... Actually, that's going to come straight across go at an angle. This will go straight down. As a matter of fact... That is going to go... Well, you know what? Let's do angles. Let's go... Let's angle that one. We'll go... In. Actually, I'm just going to go straight in. Like that. Perfect. And then what I can do around here is I can add in some parks and stuff like that because, I mean, you know, you got to have some at least. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay. I'm actually liking how like non grid like this is as compared to this, you know, this is completely straight grid up and down, left, right. 
you know this over here coming into the city is a little less you know it's a little less grid like um and it's actually kind of working out fairly well for what we're doing here all right so let's get that in there i'm actually going to create a really interesting intersection um i like that create the same thing over there i'm really liking these these really different intersections actually that works very well there and then that can go there i know this looks like total chaos but i love it I completely love it. Yeah, Vermont Hills is going to be known as Chaos. Okay, let's go there, and then this one can go there. I, You know what? Honestly, I really like that. I like, <laughs> believe it or not, I like the way that looks. I don't know what you think. What do you think? It's, I mean, it's very different, you know? It's very odd. It's very different. But you've got, like, there's an X right here. There's, you know, there's just a bunch of different things that are going on with it. Um, and by the looks of it, the buses have seemed to have found a new route to go, uh, which I guess is good, you know? Um, let's see. How many people are waiting here? I don't know. Pause. There are 10 people on there. 10. That's, uh, that's great. Totally great. Let's see how many people actually get on and over here. I mean, considering this is the main hub, you would think that there would be a lot of people that get on here, but we'll see. Uh, seven. Seven people. <laughs> oh, boy. It'll pick up eventually. It will. It will happen. You just have to wait. Um... All right, money for some reason is in the toilet. Uh, losing a bunch of money right now. That's okay. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at... Since we want this area to grow... Ooh. Wow. Well. <laughs> um, hang on. Got distracted here. Let's take a look at elementary schools. Very bad. Very, very bad. Let's see. So, I mean, yeah, we're going to interrupt some of our uh, buildings and everything, but we do need to make sure that we have the correct schooling in here. Oh, let's see. So let's go ahead and put, let's put an elementary school there. And then I'm going to go ahead and put another one over here. That's going to help out. And then why don't I put, let's kind of plan ahead here. Let's put an elementary school there high school yeah this area is very bad on education very very bad so let's put the high school there still need another one though this is definitely helping the development of this area that is for darn sure why don't I go ahead and put a high school over here next to the elementary school and I'm actually going to put a pathway in there kind of connect the two of them now let's go ahead and put in a little bit of shopping down this avenue and then I'm gonna go ahead and put a row of housing behind that See, this is what I really like. This is what I like a lot. So down here, you know, we have that policy that's on here, right? Um, so it's not building them up too, too high, but it's high enough that it's giving us a good distinction between where downtown is going and where suburbia is, you know, or where downtown suburbia is. Um, you know, we have that real nice distinct line that's happening right now. And it's actually, we're going to make it even better when it comes to down here. 
Why don't I put that there? And let's go with that. I actually want to do this. I want to put pathway down through here so it goes along the back side of the shops. And it kind of connects up. That's not going to work. That'll work, though. That way we have some, you know, we have a little bit, we have a couple of alleyways and, and walkways and stuff like that in between. <coughs> Pardon me. Well, population boomed up real fast there. We <laughs> we just gained like 5,000 people in the matter of like a couple of minutes. <laughs> that is awesome. I love it. Absolutely love it. All right, so let's add in. And this is, you know, this is what happens when you build a fairly decent city. You know, you can go in and do stuff like this and then your population just goes freaking nuts. Love it. Absolutely love it. All right, so what I want to do over here is I want to get, oh, let's see, not transportation, parks. I want to look at some parks. That one actually fits perfectly in there because, oh, wow, look at what is lacking over here. My gosh. Um, what about, what about instead of parks, ooh, plaza with picnic table. Put that there. Let's actually put. Uh, ooh. Very interesting. Wow, this is not good. This is not good at all. Um, instead of doing some parks, let's go ahead and do some landmarks or unique buildings, I should say. Uh, definitely don't want to do something that large or that. That might be a little too big. I'm trying to think of where the center of downtown is actually going to be. I think it's going to be like back in here. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put we'll put it like right in here. So we'll work on that later. Uh, what I want to do now, though, is I want to get something that's a little... No, it's too big. I want to get something that's really nice and really neat and put it in here. Like this traffic thing. This traffic thing is kind of cool. And that can actually go in right there. Now, I do have to kind of pay attention to the noise pollution of this thing because it is a little loud. Uh, let's see. Panda Sanctuary. Well, as cool as that is, it's not going to fit in here. Um, actually, it'll fit in here, though. Problem with that is that it's not going quite exactly where it needs to when it comes to coverage. All right, so give me something a little bit smaller. Here we go. Something like this. I don't necessarily want that there. Got an elementary school here. What is that? Meteor Park? Huh. Really? I don't think I could actually have that. It's going to fit perfectly right there, though. Nice. See, now that's what I'm talking about. That looks nice. I like it. I really like that. I do, actually. I really do. Okay, so we've got that going. Let me oh, let's slow this game down just a tad here. It's going a little fast. Um, all right, back into landmarks. I think over here, let's go ahead and put something like this in there. And then I'll stick a path in between going down that way. People can walk around it. Wow, I, I can't believe how much leisure this is actually taking right now in order to get this taken care of. This is freaking nuts. 
Um, did it again. I hit my freaking microphone again. These are too big. You know what? The easiest out that I have are freaking parking lots. It's the easiest thing. Just put a couple of these bad boys down in here and we are good to go. Okay, so I put one in and it did a little bit. Uh, let's put that one in there. What else do we have? What's what's actually in here? This is all residential. Yeah. Well, okay, so if I've got residential all the way throughout here, I'm not going to break that up, though. I'm just not. I like the way that looks. Dang it. Um, that's schooling, but yeah, look at that. That's not good. Do I have commercial throughout here somewhere? I do. All right, so let's do this then. Let's add... I gotta watch my time too, because let's add a parking garage in there, and then we'll add another parking garage in there. That'll help that area out. <coughs> I'm not doing too bad. I'm a little over, but you know, I want this episode to be just a little bit longer. All right, we are up to forty-four thousand people. Honestly, I think we can really make it up to fifty thousand. I really do. So I think I'm just going to keep going until that happens. I think we'll just keep expanding. Let's go ahead and get that taken care of. Okay. So that's now covered. Um, how well is that going to do? Actually, that covers that up completely. Good. Okay. So still need a bunch of residential. So we're just going to keep filling it in. This this area is going to be probably the biggest pain in the butt. Um, why don't I do this? Let's take this and go like that. There we go. <laughs> that makes it a little bit easier for me. All of that is going to be residential. For now. Might have to change it a little bit later on, but uh, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, now I can go ahead and fast forward the game again. Um, definitely want to get some, uh, some other parks in here, though, because, I, I mean, that's just not going to be enough with what I have. Those parking garages did nothing for me. Let's see, this tropical garden, actually, let me put that on the corner. And then what I can do is take that up, um, maybe, well, not anymore. Well, I can at least do, no, I can't do that, dang it. Just take it out. Fill that back in. It's already filled in. It's fine. Um, still not doing anything. This is just ugly. <laughs> this is seriously ugly. This is awful. This is really horrible. Parks and plazas, unique buildings. Like, this is seriously bad. Why is this so bad? I don't get it. Never had this problem before. All right, that helped. Let's go ahead and put another one of those like down here somewhere. Okay, that's better. Obviously, this has a lot of weight to it when it comes to, you know, leisure and stuff. <laughs> um, right, so next. Actually, you know what I don't have a whole lot of? <laughs> I don't have a whole lot of health care. Um, and by putting all this in here... Oh, well. I actually do have a lot of health care, apparently. 
But still, by putting all of this in here, I'm going to need more. So why don't I put a hospital, like, right here. And I'll put a crematorium next to it. Ooh, here we go. Sports hall and gymnasium. That's a new thing. Uh, and so is a community swimming pool. So we'll put the swimming pool... Actually, let's do this. I need an area. Actually, let's put the swimming pool there. And then, dang it, the gymnasium won't fit. Alright, can I move this? I can't move it. Crap. Alright, well, that's fine. We'll leave that there, and then I'll put... Uh... Wait, where did that go? Oh, it's under here. Yoga garden. Actually, a yoga garden can go right there. And then I can put... Uh, th 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 this can go... There's no good spot for this to go. Yeah, I'll put it over here. Fine. Alright, so that's going to help with our health in this area. Big time. Big time, big time, big time. Uh, now, I do need to go in and dezone this stuff because we want... I want that to be surrounded by other stuff. There we go. That's great. And we are, oh, we are so close to our goal. We're at 48,600. Sweet. Almost there. Almost there. So, got a lot done in this episode. So, while we're getting up to that 50,000, let's go ahead and wrap this up here, shall we? So, got a lot done here. Um, built up a huge area back here. Got University Square built up as well. Um, and also got a monorail track in here going from uh, University Square to uh, Garden Central. Or to Grand Central. Garden Central. Oh, my God. Can't talk now. I just can't. Anyway, definitely going to hit 50,000 here shortly. So we have obtained our goal today for sure. Uh, next episode, I want to pretty much focus in on getting more of this filled in, getting up to that 65,000. Um, and, you know, I had talked about putting a highway in going from here through the mountain and then connecting up to over here. But honestly, I really don't think I need it now. Traffic seems to be moving fairly well. Um, okay, for the most part, it's moving fairly well. It's, yeah, it's really not doing too bad. It really isn't. Um, I don't know. I'll take a look at that here off camera and see what happens. Hey, Metropolis. There we go. We are now a metropolis. Yes. Woohoo. We did it. We got up to that 50,000. Sweet. Now, what that does is that unlocks another tile. And what else did that do? Uh, it gave us an airport. Nice. And, I mean, honestly, at this point, it doesn't really matter which tile I unlock because we're not going to be able to do anything else until we get to 65,000 people. Um, so I'm not even going to worry about that right now. Really not. We hit our goals. We did everything we need to do. And we're good. So like I said, next episode, we're going to focus on getting these areas filled in. Um, and then from there, hopefully in the next episode, we can hit the 65,000 to unlock the rest of the tiles. That way I can get this back here unlocked and we can focus on the, uh, the main downtown area as well. Um, so yeah, fingers crossed and let's hope that that happens. So thank you everyone for joining me today. It's been a lot of fun as always. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do so. Uh, any comments, questions, or concerns that you have, please put them in the comment section down below. But that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.